set it up. Hello, 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 hello. One second. Alright, unos segundos. Oi, oi, oi. Alright, where are we at? Where are we at? Where are we at? Hello, 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 hello. One second. Sorting all this crap. Oi, oi, oi. Let's see, get this ready over here. Right. Doing this. Sorting this out, give me a second. Camera quality should be better now, by the way. Okay, put this over here. Okay, let's put the audio up. How do I put the audio up? How do I do this? Hmm, there we go, there we go. The camera quality should be fixed. Well, better, not fixed. It's still gonna be ass, but it's not, it's not a good camera in any way. But we've got something better than we had yesterday, which is what we wanted. Which is what we wanted. Is it working? Hello, 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 hello. How we looking? How we looking? We good? We good? We good? Are we good? I th Let me flip the camera around. We got a Starlink going on over here. I'll show you guys. We got a little Starlink going. Starlink. You've got the little Starlink thing going, the cable going all the way outside. I put Starlink down. So that's going. We're actually able to do this now properly. It's not gonna be fully ass. Um, my camera's stuttering a little bit because it's not made for this. Uh, as I'm using my phone. So yeah, that's what we got going on. It'll be a little bit laggy. It's not gonna be perfect. It is not the phone for it. Um, if only I had the phone for it, it would be great, but it isn't. So we are going to be doing Mustang stuff today. I'm here, I need to get my Mustang done. So I'm in a workshop today. We're gonna do some stuff on the car. You guys can watch some of it. Uh, yeah, this is really not my usual stuff. I never, I never do vlogging style. So this is very unique. Uh, it's 30 frames per second at the minute. Uh, yeah, I need to get the thing on the microphone muffled. So I don't have that for now. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So that's where we're at right now, to be honest. Uh, I'll get a better ca camera at some point. I don't know how long I'm gonna be doing this. This is 30 frames per second at the minute. So it'll be a little bit stuttery. It'll look a bit awkward. Um, but yeah, if you wanna, now I can show you guys what's actually going on around here. So let me flip the camera around. So we have the Mustang here. Here is the Mustang. Uh, so, you know, there's my car. This is the car I always talk about. Let me unwrap it. So you guys can understand what's the work being done to this thing. Uh, here we go. Let me get it all unwrapped. Let me get it all unwrapped here. It's a bit of a mess inside of it right now. It's being used as a drop box to be fair. So here is what the latest progress has been done. This is the engine bay. I've been painting, primering, sanding. This is what we got at the minute. Uh, can I put this? Yeah, there we go. Look at that. That's better camera. Oh, the camera's less stuttery there. Uh, so yeah, this is the engine bay. This is what I've done latest. Uh, we've left everything on it for specific reasons. I'll explain that. So a lot of people be like, why have you left the wheel stuff, brakes on it, whatever. Uh, the interior is a mess. Uh, we got some parts there. No, no dashboard, nothing. But uh, yeah, this is just more of a depot at the minute. I'm not going to lie. Uh, yeah, so... Um, there was some welding done here that's still being fixed up. Needs a little bit of welding here and here. Uh, nothing crazy though. And when I was going about yesterday and people shitting on my Mustang about rust, let me lift it up. Let me lift it up. Let me put this body up. All right, it might be a bit loud, but let's bring it up and I'll show you underneath. This is where the last stuff. Here's where I'm going to be putting intakes on the side. Where we got these nice little Shelby intakes here. Where are they? Here we go. Look at these bad boys. So I bought these little Shelby things. Uh, that we're going to be putting here, just for the style, not going to really, I don't think I'm going to make them functional at all. Uh, so you can see I'm going to be adding those on the side. They look pretty fucking cool. We're going to bodywork these to like, not have a line there. We're going to actually make it go along the car kind of thing, shape it around. Uh, so yeah, uh, that is not a lot of body filler actually. This is the car right there. So it's really, f it's just flat. There's not body filler at all. It's just, there's a very thin layer. Like if you see here, this is the car. The metal, like, look, the metal, like, you see the metal. This is, there's no filler whatsoever. Um, yeah, so, 
me take this back off. There we go. So that's going to be put back in there on some point. Um, all right, let's lift the car up all the way. So what I mean by it's nearly done, by the way, is that the shell does, it has like two weeks of work left on it. It's been pretty shaped, pretty done. Um, the engine bay's done. The underbody's painted. Well, let's get this up. Let's get this all the way up. There we go. There we go. There we go. Look at that. Uh, but yeah, a lot of the spots virtual, for example, here, there's body filler at the minute, a lot of it, because we haven't sanded it down yet. This has like just been put on. This is not done yet. Uh, like there's little spots here we've done, but they're, they're not really, they're not really all uh, done yet. So let me lift up all the, the car all the way up. There we go. Let me turn on this light. Here you got the wheels of the Mustang. That's the wheels of it right there. You got the Cooper, the radial GT Cooper Cobra wheel tires, whatever you want to call it. Where's the light? Let me get the light up here. Turn this off. There we go. Here you see the underneath of the Mustang. So I still need to do a little bit more on it. It needs a bit more of the GravTech stuff. So because I, you know, I've left the brake lines on it and things. So we're going to add a second layer. This is like the underneath, the underbody coating. Um, but it looks really good. As you can tell, there's no real rust anywhere. We've really cleaned everything. Uh, but yeah, you can see here a little bit at the back, like uh, what's going on. These are the old suspension that I want to try and see if I can get rid of. Uh, but no, it looks pretty good, to be honest. There's not really anything anything bad going on here. Uh, engine bay, here we got the last thing I'm finishing at the minute. So I'm going to put another coat of underbody all the way up to here, probably. All this line here. Um, yeah, I think we're going to cover up this part here, the bottom bit. There, all underneath here I need to do still. I need to do this part, this part there. And I am painting the car with these pieces on them. And the reason is this, well, it can be painted, it's not an issue. The, a lot of this is getting changed. This entire um, steering link, whatever you want to call it, all this part here is getting changed. This is getting changed. A lot of this is getting changed. There's a lot of pieces not staying on the car. Uh, have I picked the colors? Yes, I do. It's going to be like a dark gray, blue kind of thing. So, um... Yeah, that's that's what we're at right now that's what we're at this is what i've done last to paint this crap the inside of where the wings are uh and we're gonna put the black gravtex underbody stuff there as well so yeah oh that's kind of where we're at, at the minute yeah that really is it so this is what i'm doing today we got these wings it's simply to shape the car we've done all the metal work. like this has got welding wherever it needs welding. So uh, there was welding done here because there was a hole. There used to be like a trim done here. There was a little, little metal thing here. Um, and that's gone because the 70 has like a bottom trim, ugly as hell. So that's gone. Welded the holes shot, sanded it down. Uh, and there's very light layers of filler simply to shape the car because I want it to be straight. It's not to, um, to fill up the gaps or whatever. It's very light layers. Like this, it just hasn't been sanded down yet. This needs to get sanded. That was just put on. That's going to get all the way removed down to like this, where it's hardly there. Uh, but yeah, that's where we're at at the minute. That's, that's where we're at. Um, yeah. Yeah. I need to move these things around. So let me flip around the camera again. How do I do that? There we go. Yeah, we're going to be doing this... Um, yeah, chatting while I do this, show you guys a little bit of what's going on. Over here, you got all the parts of the engine I've been doing, so you can see all the the old chrome. And the reason I'm painting the chrome, as I said, there was rust here. All these little bits were rusted. And restoring, there was rust, like scratches everywhere. Uh, re restoring chrome is a nightmare, apparently, and it costs a lot, so I'm not too bothered. These were all like a little bit bent and things, we fixed them. This is all getting painted. This is all the parts that are getting painted black. Um, here I have the console bits of the inside that were chipping, so I sanded it down. We're going to be painting that black as well. Uh, besides the chrome ring inside, that's getting just to make it like fresh looking, and just a bunch of metal parts that were underneath the car that would need a bit of paint. But yeah, that's that's really where we're at. The final results we'll have it normally this summer because I got the engine done. I've got all the parts of the engine. We fixed up the heads. They've been trimmed, uh, sand. It's not trimmed, skinned. Uh, so the engine's here. We've got it put back together. Uh, we're going to be putting it back together when it's painted, which is next week normally. Um, 
And inside, I've got the transmission and stuff. Uh, let's see. I can actually go on the paint booth now without losing internet. Ba -ba -ba. So here you go. You got the transmission here. You got a bunch of parts there. I've got like the new aluminum valve covers over there. Uh, a bunch of cables. And this is the oil pan, which is going to be replacing the old one uh, here, which is a black one as well with me uh, metallic style. Looks cool. Uh, yeah, so that is where we're at at the minute. It is, you know, what it is. But yeah, I need to get cleaning that part because uh, I'm trying to get that painted this week. The Finish the underbody fully this week and uh, get the side of the wings done and the inside of the wings done so we can get it cleaned, start sanding the entire car down again for any spots of filler that need to go. Uh, which is there, I just need to sand it all down to the metal again to make sure it's just good. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's where we're at. So, yeah. There's not really any rust on this car, which is what's the impressive part, because if you go over here, so you've seen you've seen this one, how there's, there's no rust. This is all original. This is There's no rust, this is the original floor. This is all factory. Over here, um, you've got the other Mustang, which is a fucking terrible state. This, is a 68 convertible this is a rust bucket what the fuck is this like oh my god like jesus christ where the hell did you park this car that is something isn't it look even there like you can see the floor's got a hole in it like holy fuck that is interesting i mean it's a nice color um yeah, that's the that's the car there. So let's see a little bit up here what we've got on this one. Look at that. Yeah, this is this is a rusty boy. This is a rusty boy. But they've got all the new parts in there anyway. It's chill. Um, yeah, yeah, that's where we're at. Uh, show you guys a little bit around what the mechanics working on. He's got a Leyland truck here. He's been welding this thing. This thing was as bad, worse than the Mustang when it got here. I don't know if there's any of the original parts, but. This has had so much metal work done to it. He's still doing some welding there and fixing it up, but it's insane amounts of work. Um, I don't know if the metal's in there. No, no, he doesn't have it anymore. It was really impressive to see the scrap of this car. Serious salt damage, probably. Um, but yeah, this is, it's crazy. There's a car he finished in here. A Carmagia 19 something 60s. I don't know, you guys might know more about this. An old Carmagia he's finished up, painted. Uh, got running again. This was as bad as the, that Mustang as well. This was a rust bucket and it looks insane. It looks really good. It looks really good. It's crazy. Uh, but yeah, you got a Rover over there. You got a Sierra RS, a uh, Ford Sierra RS, I think it is. And there's a second one in there. You got uh, Capri right here. I think that's, no, that's not Capri. That's a Manta, the Manta 400. Uh, and up there you have a Capri, all the way over there next to the Mustang on the roof there. Uh, yeah, a little Citroen there. Nice little cars, you know? Cars. Um, and yeah, my engine I've got in the Mustang is a 302 Windsor, the original. I'm not going to change it. I want to keep it. All the original parts I've got, I want to keep the parts. I don't want to change parts out. Uh, we're going to keep everything. Uh, so yeah. Oh, God. That's where we're at. That's where we're at. So I've got the old spoiler here as well that was like shipping paint so we've sanded it a little bit down i'm gonna get a new fresh paint on that yeah it's pretty good though pretty good so same thing the wings so the wings uh, there's a bit of rust repair needed here if i can flip it around can i flip it around you can see a little bit of hole here this needs to get repaired so he's going to change this piece out um yeah so the the headlights have been left on and we've made it whole with bolts because we're going to sand it. Uh, there's been a bit of filler put on because it's from factory in the 70s and 60s. Ford Mustangs were never straight. I mean, it's a, it's a common thing and I want to make the car really straight. So this is all getting removed just to a very, very, very thin layer to have a little bit of that alignment. Like, so it will really flow along it. Uh, so that's going to get all removed. Uh, all those parts are getting removed. So that's where we're at. That's where we're at. So, is Starlink there? I think Starlink's dying. Starlink might be dying. Are we back? We're back. So yeah, this is going to get welded. I'm going to be removing all of that probably. Okay. 
I'm gonna be removing all that stuff probably in two weeks, get the headlight back off. Uh, it's really just to have it straight and nicely aligned. Because all these cars, like, they're, they're never straight, they're sideways, all this stuff. Uh, but yeah, can't wait, to, can't wait to get that going. But here is all this dirt, tar stuff. I don't know if I need to remove this top part, to be honest. This is just tar paint stuff that was protecting the car from the factory. I don't... Uh, yeah, I think that's where we're at. That's really where we're at at the minute. Buffering? Oh, yeah, that's a bit of a shame, but hope I'm doing what I can of this, honestly. But yeah, here, here's where we're at at the minute then, yeah. Anyway, I'm just gonna put you guys down for a second in front of the wing, leave you guys for a quick second. I'm just gonna go get the, the products. Give me a minute. And again, I'll say it again, because I know there's always those purist weirdos that, oh, the car needs to be factory original, it needs to be this, it needs to be, I, it's my car, I don't give a fuck, I'm making it the way I want it to be. It is what it is. Go cry about it, I don't care. I don't really care, I want to keep the engine because it sounds nice, I just don't want to be like one of those weirdos, oh, Coyote swap it, or, or keep it 100% original, let's keep the original rust on it too, very nice, and the original colors, like, no, I want it to look a bit different. And they... You can always change the color down the line again. It doesn't matter. Um, I want to enjoy the car the way I want to enjoy it. So we're going to put some brake cleaner. If this even works, does this work? Oh, this is dead. Oh, this is really dead. Is this working? There we go. Let's put some brake cleaner in here. Get this a little bit soaked up. Um, which is going to go and get all the dirt easy to scratch off kind of thing. And we're going to sand it then afterwards underneath. Uh, but... Yeah, this is struggling. Fuck. Okay. This is not wanting to come out. Why is this not coming out? Oh, I need to buy a new squeak, a squeegee bottle, I think you call it. You call it that? Yeah. What year is the Mustang? It's a 1970 Mustang. That's what it is. It is a 1970 Mustang. Uh, is this going to work? There we go. There we go. There we go. Let's get this a bit everywhere in there. There we go. Let it soak up. Let it soak up all the stuff. See, is that underneath there is the original metal of the car? Um, original factory parts. Well, I don't need new panels or anything. It's all, they're all in good condition. Um, so yeah, and the thing, like, this is a grande. It's like, oh, the, the less demanded model. So, you know, go cry about it. Um, yeah, let me go get e something to scratch off that stuff. Give me a sec. We are back, we are back. These are my best buddy tools. You got scratchy number one and scratchy number two. These um, are how we're gonna be scratching off all this stuff. So I'll let the product act a little bit then. And then if you start scratching, there you go, look at that. Just removes all of it. And I give it another wash again, again and again and again. Um, yeah. So that's where we're at at the minute. Just scratch all this stuff off. There we go. There we go, that's where we're at at the minute. Come on, come off. See, I've had to do this to every fucking part of this car. Yeah, it's raining outside and the roof is metal, so you're gonna probably hear the rain. Uh, yeah, look at all this, that is disgusting. That is disgusting, but it protected the car and it did its job. So we're gonna scratch this all off nicely. Everywhere. There we go. Nice and easy, nice and easy. How long have I had the Mustang for? About two years now, two and a half years. Right, just gonna get in, scratch all this stuff again. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna remove that top layer to be fair, I'll see. I might keep that. Cause that's still protecting the car and it's rock hard, that's not moving. This whole bottom part is just dirty, so. I'd rather remove all this stuff. Put a lead in it. There we go. Let's this off a little. There we go. 
Some of this is rough, but ah, it is what it is. Blow it off afterwards, but uh, I, I take my time of it. Uh, this transmission is a three or four speed. It's the original C4 transmission. So how many gears that has, it's that. I have no idea. Uh, you'd hate working like that. Well, I mean, to be fair, everything's busy at the minute. All the stands are, I need to check. Do I have a stand? Cause hooking, this thing is fucking massive. I need to find a stand to put this on, but it's fine. I'm just scratching. Cause I'm, then I can just flow it all over and it's chill. I, th I don't know what exactly speed. Let's put some more product in here. Oh fuck it, I might dip some. Here we go, let's go. Just put some of this stuff in here. Let it go a bit everywhere, cause it is, the squeegee thing is not working. Um, anyway, and as I'll say again, I'm no fucking mechanic. I am doing this the way I'm doing this. I'm not an expert. There's probably a million ways better to do this. It's just your average gaming YouTuber that is doing a Mustang <laughs> fucking somehow. But I just do this because I want to do my own car. And you know, you'll be, I'll be able to say like, I did my car, I worked on my car and uh, yeah. And then I'm going to get all this off, blow it off and clean it again with some pre-clean. And then we're going to spray a primer. And then we're going to start, oh, I'll probably get this bit off here. There's a bit of crap there. there we go. Look at this. Look at all that crap flowing down. Jesus. There we go. Yeah, we get it all down. I don't understand why people wanted to watch this. Um, oh, hello, who? Super chat, my Coyote. Uh, come to Texas and I'll let you ride my Coyote F-150. It's not slow. Uh, <laughs> uh, I've ridden an F-150, actually. My, uh, my aunt in America has one, so. Uh, do you wear full mask, gloves, and primer? I should, but I don't, because I just don't. <laughs> and it's not high-built primer. If it was high-built primer, yeah, I'd wear a mask, but it's just the aerosols, because this is not where, like, the paint's gonna be. This is underbody. This is not really a bother. Um, and it's raining a lot. Jesus Christ. Let's get this going. This will take a hot minute, but... Scratch all this stuff. This takes quite a bit of time because you nearly, literally need to go um, over and over and over and over and over again. So, God, that's dirty. Oh, God. Get all this product over here again. here. Oh, nightmare fuel. All right, let's see. Let's see. Uh, based on demand, people are looking for, yeah, so the thing is, everyone's starting to buy these Mustangs, I noticed now in the last year, because the fastbacks are getting too expensive. So everyone's buying these coupes. So it is. Pretty good wipe there. Let's see if I can, I'm just gonna get some more product in here if it will work, cause um, I had this squeegee bottle, but I think it's dead. Okay. Are you gonna put frost protection? Yeah, there's gonna be rust protection on this. Jesus, of course. Uh, there we go. Let's get all, oh, it's really not going. Oh. You need the boys to help out. Yeah, the boys don't want to do this. They, they are like, oh, I, I buy a new car, car, done. I build my car. Yeah. I'm not getting anything done this stream. Yeah, well, it is Kieran, mate. You are whatever you want. You want to cry about a purist Mustang? That's not me, so have fun. We're not going to finish the Mustang this stream. This is literally just going to be the wings scratched down. I don't even think I'm going to paint them today. Like, uh, primer them. Let's see. This is a, just a long process, and I take my time with it as well, so. There we go, scratch all this bit off here. All the inside as well. Oh, you don't really see it, but yeah, look at this crap everywhere. On here, nice as well. Get all this crap off. Just built different, yeah, it is what it is. Ba-da-da. 
Right. Oh, God. Let me scratch. There we go. It's coming all off nicely, though. Look at that. You can kind of see it. Kind of. Like, see? It just comes off. Then I'm going to spray it all down again. Uh, then air spray. Then clean one more time a pre-clean. Uh, and then it should be good. I don't know if I should remove this stuff. I don't know. Um, triggering my OCD. Well, mate, <laughs> I'm not a mechanic. Like, I'm just like a guy in a garage building my own car kind of style. Like, I'm not going to be perfect about it. It won't be. Um, I just want to do it myself because I just feel like, you know, it's, it's an experience kind of thing to do. And I'm learning a lot, to be fair, about it over time. Like, there's a lot of things I'm learning. Uh, I think, I, I don't know if I should leave this stuff. Uh, does any mechanic here know about this? This is like the original stuff. I, I don't think it's a problem removing this. This part here, just like this little layer of thick, like very, like it's not even chipping off. It's like tar or something. I'm not quite sure, but I think I could primer over it and then put the Gravtex over that because I, I don't think it's really doing anything bad anyway. Um, leave it as it sounds. It's a sound deadener. Oh, is it? I mean, it's the art. It's the arches. So a little bit of fluff on chin. Tori, what the fuck? You could leave it on. Yeah, I think I'll leave it on. I'm not going to. I'm just removing this bottom layer because this is trash. Uh, yeah, leave it. It's road protection, yeah. It's just this bottom part here. Oh, God, this is not spraying for shit. It's got no pressure. Um, the new stuff will stick. It needs sanding. Yeah, I'll sand it a little bit, uh, but I'm not going to... I'll sand a little bit. Yeah, exactly. I'll just sand it a little bit, like give it a light layer of sanding. Uh, did I miss a super chat? Shit, sorry. Uh, Hennessy, it would be interesting to see if there's code that will allow you to do an RL... What the fuck do you mean? Uh, there we go. Let's just... There you go. Look at that cleanness underneath there. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. Look at that. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna flip it. I'm gonna let it drain for a little bit. We're gonna start the other one, and then I'm gonna clean this again. So let me just go here and flip this bad boy. Fucking hell. Right. Oh, let's get this flipped. We go here, and I'm just gonna let it drain a little bit. Oh, that is dirty. Oh, God, that's black stuff. Ugh. It is what it is. Right, let's just flip it upside down. We're gonna leave it like this for now. Because it's not gonna hang on there, it's flat surface, so. Ugh! Look at that, disgusting. Ugh. I'm not putting any gloves on because I, I just can't be asked. Anyway, it's not like a bad product in the stuff anyway, it's just cleaner, so. Not, my hands aren't gonna burn. Uh, let me get a wipe though and wipe it off. Right, we got next wing to go and start and clean. So that one's gonna be just getting all the product off it, and I'm gonna spray it again. And I might put it on a something to hang it. See, the problem with the mint is on a lot of stuff. Like, all these tables I were using for the Mustang. I got these, actually. I could use these. Uh, I'll see. Because he's working on that truck over there, so... Yeah, we're going to let the wing clean off a little. Oh, my God, look at that. Dirty girl. Look at it. Beautiful. All right. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I think that top part, I'm just gonna leave it. I'm not that bothered. I'll just sand it down a little bit. Okay. Yeah, I'll sand it down a little bit and we'll do it that way now, so let's go. Put this over here. And we got wing number two that we need to grab. So, how are we gonna do this? Uh. Grease to work on your Frenchie hoodie. Yeah, see, I don't, these are like, I got so many of these hoodies. Uh, I've got too many of them, so I'm just wearing them for like doing handiwork. Uh, I've got like six, seven, eight of these, so I'm not too worried. Where's the Mustang? Right there. There it is. There is uh, the Mustang. Look at that bad boy. <laughs> it's a dirty girl. Yeah, I did. Uh, right, okay. This. Oh, this chunk of metal. A little bit heavy. I'm trying to be careful not to break it because this thing's a little bit fragile. Well, fragile. It's metal, but I don't want to bend it because then more metal work, more fun. Uh, there we go. Let's put it here. Let's see how number two looks. You know what? This one's actually in better... Actually, this one's in better condition than the other. Let's see. Let's turn this bad thing around. Let's turn you around. Here we go. This one is really not that dirty, actually. 
Same thing you got that, but this is actually a lot. Ow. My fucking poor ears. Um, it's a little bit of sanding to here. But, yeah. 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 Yeah, we'll, we'll put more product here. Um, it's not that bad. It's a lot better than the other side. The other side is a lot dirtier, so this will probably be easier. And then I'll sand it down. Right, let me get some more product because the bottle's empty. Oh, yeah, let me carry you guys with me. Let's go. Let's go on a ride. Uh, what the hell? Mosquitoes or something? Um, but yeah, look at this. Look at this. See? This is all going to get changed because I want to get coilovers proper, like, co and the back as well. So. I'm not bothered about those getting some spray on it. So, any OCD mechanics, I'm sorry. It is what it is. Uh, let me put this here. Where is the brake cleaner? Let me get some. It's not a brake cleaner. Oh, I got it. Here we go. Actually, is this brake? Actually, wait, I have the other bottle. I forgot I had two bottles. So, I've got one bottle, and I have another bottle ready, but the spray thing doesn't work. So, we're just going to take the bottle, uh, and we're going to put this stuff on it. There we go. Uh, but yeah, see you can see a little bit of welding was done here. This is gonna be taken off because we're just testing like there's some welding that was done there But we're gonna take that piece off because we're just testing more of the fitting of the doors because the doors had some welding work done to them uh, Here as well, you can see a little bit of welding done there, but that's the same thing that's gonna get fixed up Because uh, I don't remember what was wrong there. There was a little problem there Here there was an issue. This was this has been cut out a little bit underneath there. There was uh, fiberglass hiding damage here, so we need to cut this off. This is this is all like whoever welded this before didn't do great. It's a pretty shit job. So mechanic's gonna be doing that one again. So he's doing all the welding. I don't want to do the welding. I'm scared of fucking it up. <laughs> I won't lie. I don't want the car to be fucking lopsided like Elite. You know, we don't want an Elite Prime, do we? Camera around. There you go. Let's get this thing going. There you go. Can I can I make this a little bit? Nope. There we go. Let's, let's put some more product in here. Yeah, this is a lot cleaner than the other side. It's going to be quicker. Oh, this is much better. Jesus. Look at that. That's actually a lot cleaner. Nice. Some crap stuff there. There we go. There we go. Look at that. Put a little bit there. Just spray it all over the place. Nice. Am I using P20 or P80? I'm using 320 because it's not, I don't need to sand it that much. Lobsided like Elite. Yeah, we don't want a lobsided Mustang to be like Elite Prime, you know. Uh, let me get the scratchy stuff again. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Let's go. Ugh. Right. This is going to be the slowest stream I've ever done in my life and probably the lamest because I'm literally just I don't know why people wanted to watch this. I'm literally sitting here spraying shit and scratching shit and yeah, that's what it is. Why don't you pressure wash it? Uh, cuz it's not really needed and I don't there's no pressure washer here so I'll probably get one. Uh, we did pressure wash the underbody at one point. I brought a rented one. Um, oh, this is actually really clean. Wait a minute. This doesn't even have any fucking dirt. This really doesn't have any dirt here. This is just like surface dust. Here's a little bit on this end over there. You got a little bit here, but not much. There's some here. But here it's all like clean. What the fuck? Huh. Uh, okay. You could wipe. Yeah, I could probably wipe that off with a rag. I'm not going to lie. This is. This is definitely. Uh, this could definitely be wiped off. Okay. This. There we go. Get all that crap off. We're gonna get an air blower and blow all the crap off after anyway. Okay. Let's do this. What motor are you putting in it? I'm keeping the original, which is a 302, uh, it's just a dick. What the fuck is that name? Uh, let's get this side over here scratched off as well. 
Uh, oven cleaner works great if you want. I'm, I don't really, I've got brake cleaner and it's doing wonders on this. There we go. Yeah, the rest I think it will wipe off. I'm not gonna lie, this will probably just wipe off. Oh, that is working wonders. Look at that, it's gone. Uh, oh my God, the rain. Why is it so bad today? There you go, put some more. Just a little scratching. I think I'm just gonna wipe this off. There we go. There we go. Oh shit, you fell over. Sorry guys. I didn't mean to drop you. Uh, rather eat, watch you build and restore beautiful card and elite eat cheesecake. What the fuck? Um, need a 351 Windsor and loved it. Uh, need a wire wheel. I got a wire wheel. Actually, you know what? I might use the wire wheel. Uh, I do have a wire wheel. You know what? Yeah. I got a wire wheel. There we go. Let's get this a bit more sprayed. I'll probably get the wire wheel on this. Because it's not much. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to wipe this shit off now and we're going to wire wheel it. Got a bunch of rags here we're gonna use, so. Uh, let's try this. Wire wheel put safety on, yeah, I'll, I'll, I will, I will. I mean, I, I don't know if I'll use the wire wheel, I got like this little drill bit that's like wire brush kind of thing. There we go. Let's go, let's try and wipe this crap off, see what it does. Yeah, you know what, that's pretty good. That is pretty damn good. That's actually removing it really well. Um, let's see. How are we going to do this? Let me do this this way. There we go. Nice. Nice. Let's do it. Wipe this stuff off. Oh, that is coming right off. Look at that. Look at it. Beautiful. It's coming right off. I'm, I'll let the product act a little bit and then we're going to wipe it. There we go. Let's, let's put some crap on here. There we go, a little bit here, a little bit here. And we'll wipe it all off after. Uh, and I'm gonna get some fire it, so let me see. I do have something, there's like a tool he's got here. Fuck, where is it? Here, let me grab this. So, if I grab this, right? And there's these little brushes, he's got little heads. Um, where do you put them though is the question. Here we go. This is what I'll use. It's for a drill. It's a drill bit. So you see this? It's like a little drill bit. This will do the job. It's not a wire wheel per se. Uh, but that will do. That will do the trick. That will do the trick. Uh, that will do the trick. And get this drill bit off here. Put this on. Let's try it. Why is this not? Why is this not getting tight? That sounded wrong. Why did I say that? Let's put this in. There we go. There we go. Let's go put this stuff on and scrub it. Let's scrub it with this stuff. That will do the trick. That will do the trick. Uh, all right. Safety glass is full. I don't need safety glasses for that. That'll be chill. I won't. If I die, I'm sorry, guys. Stream's over. Uh, okay. Let's see. If she says it's not getting tight, buddy, run away. What the fuck am I saying? Oh. Man, let's, let's scrub all this shit off here. Let's get all this crap everywhere off. And we'll wire wheel, not wire wheel. Well, I don't know what you call that. What do you even call that? A wire drill bit? There we go, wiped it all off. And let's try this shit. Let's see how this does. Let's get on the edges. Let's, let's do it this way. Let's see. Come on. You know what? That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Oh, it's getting rid of all the excess dirt. That's actually really good. 
Uh, do I know the history of the Mustang? Yeah, I know it was exported. It was bought by a guy in France, a dealer, and then I bought it from him. So I'm the first owner after the States. It's a two owner car. A family owned this car for the whole time. Uh, let's see. Oh, that's good. Look at that. There we go. That's actually pretty smooth now. That's actually pretty good. You could use a coned wire wheel. Yeah, I'll, I'll see. I've got some other bits to get the edge. But there's this part here. Let's see. Can I do this? Will you guys be able to sit there? Yeah. Let's get all this shit removed. There we go. It's a bit of surface rust there, nothing bad. Yeah, a bit of surface stuff there, I can remove that. You guys are moving with the wing, that is... Am I good with, uh, I'm not good with blue screens of death. No, I have them every now and then. There we go. Let's get this going. Yeah, I'll probably sandpaper that, that's not bad. Uh, yeah. Let's see. I think I'll just get sandpaper and straight... Because this is really not bad. This is... It's actually pretty good. Uh, there, it's not as bad as the other wing. The other wing is way dirtier. Uh, I think I'll get 320 sandpaper and I'll just scrub it a little bit. Because, yeah. I'll probably scrub it by hand as well. I'll just grab the sandpaper, fold it, and scrub it by hand. I had sandpaper somewhere around. Where did I put it? Where did I put the sandpaper? We had sandpaper somewhere. But I don't know where it is now. Is it here? No. What did I do with it? I had it the other day. Great. I have no idea where the sandpaper is. Uh, da, da, da. Do you have the shoes drip, mate? My shoes right now. You guys want to see my shoes? Uh, look at this. I'll probably use 180. Yeah. Underneath the wing. Look at the shoe drip. Look at this drip, boys. Drip check right now. Fucking amazing. Look at that stylish shoes. Completely ruined by grease. You know, it's great. It's great. It is doing absolutely fabulous. I might take, f yeah, 80 grip, 80 grip might be better. Where's all the sandpaper? What the fuck? I had loads. Uh, I had a box I bought and I'd put somewhere and I don't know where it is. Hmm, mystery. All right, I'm gonna leave you guys hanging here looking at the Mustang for a minute. I'll be right back. You give me a second. I'm just gonna try and find a sandpaper. I have found the sandpaper. We are good. I found the sandpaper. You can't park there, mate. Yeah, I can park there. It's good parking. Uh, okay, let's get this. Uh, turn black with the tire grease. Yeah, it's it's great. The drip check's but it's on point, isn't it? Good drip check. Right, so I've got sandpaper. I'm going to do this. Normally, you'd put these on thingies, but I'm going to do this by hand. Um, is that cab off a 50s truck? Yeah, it is. Uh, so I'm just probably going to do this by hand. There we go. You know what? That is doing the trick. Look at that. A lot cleaner. And then this I can primer afterwards anyway. I'll do a little bit of 320, so. Yeah, that's doing the trick. Yeah, that'll do. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that'll work. There we go. Yep. Nice. Not bad. You missed your paint chat. What do you say, Dark? Let's see. Did I miss it? What do you say? Love you. Wait, what the fuck? Uh, I didn't mean to do that. Guys, we're at seven hours and a half. Time's going down. Beautiful. You're going to use Elite Prime. What the fuck? What, is it hurting you guys' ears, the sanding? I'm sorry. Lower the volume when I'm... Hey, volume warning. I'm about to sand metal. This will probably burn your ears. 
Uh, we're gonna do this side here now. I don't know if you can really see it. Here you go. I'm gonna do up here. You guys see that? Yeah, you guys see that. All right. Let's get this part here going. There we go. Look at that. I need to get this off, but this is moving with it. Oh, I'm sorry for your ears. This is probably horrible. Uh, let's see. Yeah, just surface stuff. That's not an issue. pretty good parts pretty scratched down there lovely sound glad you love it uh, let's see Mustang badge there's like little hooks here that go for the Mustang badge on the side so I can't really do anything about those there we go. nicely sanded down everywhere Does anyone have tetanus? Because you're about to fucking get it. There we go. There we go. Noise. Noise. Oh, God. But 2JZ, you are about to make me insult you. Oh, what are people saying in chat? Let's see. The vlog camera's better than my face cam. I doubt it. It's probably my settings are messed up on my camera. Uh, what part of that the car? This is the wing, or I think, I don't know what you call it in America, but here you call it the wing. Uh, this would cost me over $30,000 for someone to do this. I know that for sure. There we go. Scratch all this crap. I have an attachment I bought, by the way, where I'm going to put it on like a shirt kind of thing, where you guys all have the camera attached to me. So you'll move around with me. It won't be like static. We'll see. I don't know if it will do well or not, that... Oh, look at that. That's that's pretty good. That is pretty good there. Look at that. All sanded down. And we're going to blow the blow it all off. And yeah, yeah, we're going to blow all that off after. It's called the fender. Oh, yeah, it's the fender. That's what it was. Okay. And let's sand this bit down a little. Yeah, this part... Yeah, let's just sand it down a little bit, not crazy amounts, because that will hook on after. This is like protection layer. This is not really anything. The driver's front wing or passenger. Yeah, this is the wings here. So uh, right now I am doing the driver wing. So yeah, your brain scratching, I'd imagine. Hey, you guys enjoying that sound of scratching? You might get your fingers amputated for not using gloves. Fuck it. We'll get robot hands. I'll go cyberpunk style. There we go. Let's scratch this part. Guys, I, I love doing ASMR, and I hope this is music to your ears. This is like ASMR, guys, right here. Going to do the ASMR sand, sand, sanding. Let me put the microphone right up and personal so you guys really feel it. And it's going through your soul that way, you know? There we go. Look at that. Oh. Love that sound scraping. What the fuck? Flesh is weak, metal strong. It is what it is. Uh, music two years. What the fuck? You guys have problems. Botnik Louis. What the fuck? 
Uh, right, well, we're gonna do this side here now. We got that part there nicely done. This part here, then sand the bottom down here. <sighs> Why is it so rusty? That's not rust, that's like dirt. That's just dirt. Uh, da -da 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 -da. All right, let's fucking go. Oh, it's hurting your eyes. What the fuck? Okay, okay. You guys like the sound? What the fuck? You guys have issues. Let's get in there. All right, let's move you guys over here this time, and I'm gonna go around. There we go. Uh. All right, let's go on this side now, and let's scrub it. Let's do a bit of scrub daddy here, doing a promotion of the sponge and all that. is pretty damn good. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Ice blast it. Yeah, I heard about the ice blasting stuff, but take it by Los Santos Customs. Fuck, yeah. Are you, what the fuck? You guys have issues. What the fuck? What is wrong with you guys? Oh, God, we got to keep this going. Sand this part down now, but this is what my life has been for a while now. I'm just sanding down my goddamn car. It was a nightmare when I took off the paint. I went with a sander and I removed all the paint with the sander. All the way to bare metal. <sighs> okay. Fixing up the Autobots. Oh my god. Okay. Let's go. Keep it down here. I'm gonna actually I'm gonna blow the air off of this. I'll probably blow it in that direction. So let me move this. Why is the other wing so much dirtier than this one? What the fuck? Why is the other one so much? Okay, right. Let's get there's a blow air air compressor thingy. Uh, I think we're gonna do that. We're gonna blow the air onto that and we're gonna remove all the dirt. Okay. Let's do that. This might be loud. Sh warning, sound warning. Lower your volume. You guys might have ear bleeds in a minute. Uh, let's see, let's put this here. Can I do this? I can do this. No, I can't do this. Can I do this? Well, that's sort of working. Okay, well, we're gonna do this. Got this air stuff. Is that in? No, it's not in. There we go, it's in. Okay. All right, let me grab the air stuff and grab you guys. You're coming with me, aren't you? Volume warning, guys. Volume warning. You're about to... I don't know if this will be loud or not, but we're about to find out. Okay, let's get some air blown on this, so... Any of you guys fell asleep? I'm sorry. You're welcome. Hope your ears have burnt. You're welcome. Oh, well, Pierce is louder than that thing. Okay, never mind. If it's not too loud, you're, you're good then. There we go. Put that back. Uh... That's actually pretty good. You know what? That's really good. This is sanded down a little bit. This is nicely sanded. I'm gonna sand a bit more here. Um, we're gonna sand a bit more down here as there's some chipping. 
Here, I think it's pretty ready. We just need to clean it up and we might, I might I'm gonna do this. We're gonna clean up. I'm gonna sand down a little bit more in that corner there, I think. Uh, yeah. Maybe a bit up here as well on the thingy. But yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll do that and then I'll, I'll leave this stuff on it. Is there any actual mechanic here? I think leaving this is fine, right? This is just under like sound deadening. I sanded it down a little bit for primer to grip, but this is like, it's not dirt. It's just some brown, dark, black, whatever it is. Uh, yeah. It might lag every now and then. I am on Starlink. Starlink does have hiccups. That's fine like that. Okay. This part here is not getting painted. This is like undercoat. It's not actual paint. Um, so yeah. We're gonna sand a little bit here in the corner. Getting all the surface sand, getting all this chip because if I paint this uh, undercoat or this, this will all like be visible anyway. So I'm gonna get all this removed. You're never gonna see this part of the car. What am I saying? But I'd rather it be done proper. Wheel arch done. And I think that's pretty ready. This might be ready, chat. I think we're ready to blast this one more time of air. And that will be ready for primer, I think. This part here will be ready. I just wipe it down with some pre-clean after. Uh, afterwards, make sure there's nothing left. Uh, yeah. I've sanded it all down. All this has been sound. Why don't I have TTS? I'm, I'm streaming on my phone. Wait, I missed a chat. Uh, gaming, don't leave it when you spray it with protector. It'll never stick. Will it not? Because I've sanded it down to the most. It's very minimal. It's not much left of it. Is that, does that, can that really not stay? Because it's, it's, it's not like dirt. This is like what was sound deadening the car, I guess. Because I've sanded it down already a pretty good layer. Uh, so I think, yeah, I'm going to air blast this one more time. Let's air blast it one more time. Uh, can I go back down? There we go. There we go. Micro dust stuck in the fibers. I'll see. Oh, I see. I'll have to see, because the thing is, it's it's underbody. This is not like, this is not going to be painted, per se. There you, go. there you go. like a plain power wash simulator. Oh, okay. Okay. There we go, there we go, there we go. I'm gonna put this here. Should we check out that other wing, what it's like? Uh, you want it coated well? Yeah, I've got the Gravtex. It coats it really well. I'm not really worried about it being badly coated. This is the dirty bastard. This here, that's gonna get all removed, by the way. That's just, I'm shaping the car. Getting all the car shaped nicely. So let's move this a little bit. Oh, this boy is chunky, still dirty. Fuck me. Why are you so dirty in here? Why are you so dirty? Hmm. Oh, I'm getting it protected from moisture. It's gonna be protected. 
I've got GravTex, which protects it. Oh, I'll see. We'll, we'll see. We might remove it then. It's sandblasting. Uh, it got sa some parts got sandblasting, but not the whole thing. Sandblasting is a fortune of you to get the sand and everything. Um, fuck me. This is still dirty as fuck. There's still loads of shit in here. Okay. Okay. All right. I think I'm gonna blast this with some air. All right, give me a second. Sandblasting cost a fortune. That's why I didn't. I sanded the whole car myself to the metal. The entire shell was sandblast. Uh, was uh, sanded down by me. Uh, it took months. Use a signed air grinder sander. I have an actual sander. I could try sanding it down of an actual sander. Let's see. The problem. The problem is, it's so dirty. It is actually so dirty that the, the sandpaper is going to wear out in seconds. Let's grab this. The, the sandpaper will wear down in seconds. Uh, so let me scratch this off a little bit more and then I'm going to blast it of air. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to blast this of air a little bit after. Here you go. That's coming real well. That's actually coming off pretty well now. Uh, leaving the product on it a little bit. It, it reacted a little bit there. Look at that. That's coming off pretty nicely now. Ah, oh, there we go. All right. I'm gonna use the wire brush. Then we're gonna air blast it, and then I'm gonna sand it. Pretty good. That's pretty good. Uh, okay, here we go. That is pretty good. Oh, Jesus, tiring. Um, let's go down this part here a little bit. Let's get this all off. Yeah, it's coming all off. Uh, that's pretty good. No oh, crap. Is this working? Why is the mic acting up? The mic was acting up there. Uh, Frenchie's my daddy, Lawrence my mic. What the fuck, Anthony? Uh, what year is the Mustang? 1970. Let's this down. Huh. There's something there. No, it's good. I thought there was a bit of something going on behind there, but no. Everything is okay. Okay. Oh, let's see. There we go. Nice. Nice. Get this side here done now. Let's put this a little bit here. Uh, okay. There we go. Get around the back. This is actually doing a pretty damn good job. I need to get all this scrubbed off though. Holy fuck. Let me scrub it off there. There we go. And I'll blast it there. Yeah. Okay. That's actually removed really nicely now. Look at that. It's pretty gone. That's getting pretty clean now. All the black stuff's gone. <sighs> go. Scratch all this parts here off. Goddamn nightmare. There you go. <sighs> Am I keeping the color original? No, I'm changing it to like a blue, a blue gray mix with black stripes and blue pinstripes. It's gonna look pretty fucking wild. I can't wait to see it done. It'll take a hot minute, but I can't wait to see it when it's done. Um, da, 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 da. Okay. 
Hello, Jimbo. How are you doing? Welcome to the life of my pain and suffering. Okay. There we go. Just scratching all this crap off. <sighs> what is that? I heard noise. Oh, this, look at all this. Look at that gunk everywhere. Uh, gaming, this here is getting cut off. This is getting repaired. I know what you mean. The, this hole here, this is where there's rust from sandblasting. Um, this is getting cut off and repaired, this piece. So this part, don't worry about it. That's going away. That's getting fixed. That's gonna, the mechanic's gonna cut this off. I'm just gonna primer this whole top bit. This part, I'm not gonna grav text it yet. Um, we're not gonna grav text this wing yet because this one has rust here that damaged it. Um, but the rest of the thing's right, it's fine. There's no holes anywhere else. But here, this is gonna get um, repaired right here. He's gonna cut it off. Uh, oh, right. Let's keep it going. Nice and easy. Okay. There we go, right. I'm just gonna get this sand down right here around the edges and uh, we're gonna blow it up off a little bit. Yeah, I can't really look at the M's for now. Oh, there we go. We're back. Yeah, that brush, yeah, it's doing the job. I'm, I'm gonna have to clean it because it's got all the gunk shit in it now. There we go. I can't really look at DMs, mate. Um, yeah, these bristles are fucked. They're fucked now, yeah. I fucked it. I'll need to buy a new one. But I'm just trying to scratch a minimum of it off and then I'll get rid of it. Uh, it is removing the stuff though. Like, look here, it's, you can tell it's removing everything. So that's all I really need it to do. Scratch all the edges off. Uh, yeah, the brush, is, this is what happens when you do a Mustang forever, using a brush. Um, I got another smaller one though. It's good as the other wing has no, uh, no rust, so. It was just this wing at the bottom had a bit of rust. That's what's the good part about it. There we go, scratch it all off. There we go. That's good, that's good, not bad. <sighs> that's pretty good. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna blast it a bit air now, just see what it looks like. Let's get some air blast in there. This is looking really good, look at this piece, that is nice. That is nicely clean. That's just like metal and black old stuff on it that's sanded down, so we're pretty good on it. Let's air blast this bastard. Fuck power tools, who needs them? Exactly, who fucking needs them? All right, I'm just getting the... Oh, this is not coming out. Come on. Can you come out? There we go. There we go, let's go. Let's see. Look at that. There you go. Uh, that's not going to go out for there, so I'm probably going to have to rotate this around because I don't want it to go back that way. Uh, let me rotate the wing around. Let's put this the other way around real quick. Oh, God, that is a lot of dirt. I can see all the dirt there. Look at that. All that crap that was cleaned off of it. Uh, have foam pans on the ground. Uh, it's getting reworked, like the metal work on it's not done. So uh, it's, it's getting done up and I'm gonna put it back over on the tables after anyway, just seriously, just to clean it. Let's put through here, can we go through? There we go. Oh. 
ten percent rule. What the fuck is that? Oh, that's a lot better. Look at that. Much better now. It's a little bit there. Not much. Much cleaner. That's much better. Uh, a little bit there to scratch, and then we'll do sanding that down a little bit. Oi, oi, oi. Okay, okay. We have got this going. Right, let me get the stuff. All right, uh, give me a second chat. I just need to sort this. Can I pause this? No. See, I don't have a pressure washer. Stop bringing up the pressure washer. I don't have one. Uh, is that a ringtone? What the fuck? Who's calling me? Ah, oh, never mind. Keep this going. We're about to hit six hours. Fuck yeah. Let's go. Let's fucking go. All right. Let's try this. Let's keep this going a little bit. Yeah. We're going to put, we're going to sand this part down a little here. Oh, all right. This part here. Shall get to there after. Pretty good. Uh, on this day, 1964 was the day that the Mustang was... Really? Was it this today in 64? Jesus. And here I am streaming, building my Mustang. <laughs> okay. Oh. This is rough. What's the car in the background? There's a few. I don't know which one you're on about. down here this is a 40 grit because i'm just trying to get scratch here if it's scratched underneath it's not a big deal uh because i'll uh, get it all removed anyway uh it's, sorry it's getting all grav text here anyway so it's just like undercoating this is not part of the car that's like painted it's going to be undercoated there we go there we go so i'll put this wing on the side after because i know this is going to need some welding work uh there we go Let's get this part here. There we go. Uh, the black car. What black car? Oh, over there. That is a uh, Chrysler 300, uh, 5.7 liter, 5 .7 liter Hemi in it. Uh, so yeah. Here, let me show you the Chrysler. The Chrysler is pretty damn nice. Here it is. This is the Chrysler right here. You got a nice, there's a 5.7 liter Hemi in this thing. It is, he's repairing at the minute. Apparently it's got some leaks or something. So it's a bit apart at the minute with no cover on it. But um, yeah, this thing looks nice. Look at those wheels, 22 inch, Jesus fuck. That's huge, huge car. But um, yeah, yeah. So uh, that is that, all right, let's keep going. Let's keep sanding this bastard down. I think we'll, we'll keep doing that. Okay. Uh, there's a bit of product there, but not much. So we'll keep sanding the middle bit here, all the way back there. And then we'll put this one on the side, probably just a light layer of primer so it doesn't rust. Um, because it needs to get welded. There needs to cut off a piece there at the bottom. This part rusted a little bit, so that needs to get some welding. Uh, yeah. Okay, let's go. Do I have custom exhaust pipes? I have a uh, Super 44's 
uh, flow masters being put on the car. Okay. Da -da -da. Oh. There we go. That is pretty good. Super 10s are the loudest. I don't want Super 10s. I want it to be like, I have a valve actually. I'm gonna have an opening valve system. We're at six hours 59 chat, look at that. We made it to six hours and 59 minutes. We have made it to a nice time there. Look at that, beautiful. Beautiful. That's nice, that's good. I like that. I like that. Ah, it's satisfying that. Six hours and 59 minutes. Beautiful. Oi, oi. Oi, 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 oi. There we go. Look at that. Sanding it all down nicely. Okay. Uh, I'll use the wire wheel in a bit. I'm just sanding it down a little bit here, getting it all off. There we go. And here. Nice. Nice. There we go. Keep it going. <sighs> Come on. This is tiring. But we're doing it. You remember how close we got to going on to three hours today? Oh my god, yes. We might make it back down to three hours. Who knows? Let's go. Let's keep this going. This corner over here. Put that up here a little bit. Get this side down. Nice. There we go. That's better. Oh, it's not looking too bad now. Look at that. That's actually a lot cleaner than it was when we started this side. That is so much cleaner. It's great. Good to see it that clean. I think we're gonna put some more air into it, just to get stuff out. There we go. Oh, yo, 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 yo. Okay, not bad, not bad. Okay. That is pretty damn clean. I might sand that top part down now a little bit. Uh, I, what time is it? Oh, it's okay. We have decent time. Let's see. Uh, see, this part's actually really good now. Elite Tetris stream. Oh my god. Uh, this is pretty damn good. Look at that. That's pretty damn good. Not bad, that. Not bad. Not bad at all. Current state of the car. It's over there. It's not bad. It has some filler on it that we need to sand down because they're just shaping the car. Um, that needs to get sanded all the way down. Here you've got But here you can see like there's really no filler at all. It's, this is it. It's super thin. Um, and you can see the metal there still a little bit. But uh, it's, we're just shaping the car because this used to be a vinyl top over on top of this. There was a whole line going here. Um, but it's been shaped nicely. So yeah, it's looking pretty damn good uh, In there, there's no rust. That's just like the sound deadening bullshit Here's the old steering wheel that I'm removing all these old cables and stuff. Uh, we got a master kit of What do you call them? Yeah, all those little bits. I don't know what you call those pieces, but you know what I mean uh, Yeah How's the frame of the car? It's fucking great. You can see it there. It's already been undercoated Looks great. The car's in pieces, it's not bad. Yeah, well, it's being re re rebuilt, it's different. The, up there, you can kind of see it. That's where my exhaust is. All the way up there, you got the drive shaft. The exhaust system's in that box. Uh, over here, you have the interior of the Mustang, all the way up there. 
that's it wrapped. That's the back rear seats, the front, the door panels. But that's the whole interior of the car. Uh, all wrapped up. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Okay, I'm trying to figure, think how I'm going to go about this now. Because it's not that bad now. It's actually pretty good. Um, I might sand it up here a little bit more. But it ain't that bad. Okay. Let's see. I'm trying to see which one. What am I going to go about it now? Uh, how am I going to go about it? Hmm. How am I going to go about it? Do I want to sand that down a lot? I might. What carburetor will we be using? I got a two-barreled carp. It's it's a since it was a coupe, it doesn't have a four-barrel, but a two. But I might get a four-barrel on it. I'll see if I get a four-barrel. But I can't wait for it to be done. Honestly, it'll look insane. Uh, right. Let's see. Yeah, I'm probably just gonna go around, sand this whole section a little bit down. Let's see. Now the question is, am I removing the whole thing or not? A holly carb. It's the stock carb. It's a Ford whatever it is, the original carburetor from factory. Um, that's what it is. Okay. Da -da 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 -da. Pretty good there. There we go. That's not bad. Wouldn't worry about the top part as long as the primer sticks, yeah. After the thing is, it's this is just sound deadening. That's not dirt. It isn't. There's microparticles, but like I'm gonna spray it all down and sand it anyway. Because this is on this is not getting like high build paint. This is seriously just being underbody. Um but yeah, we're just gonna This part is not getting primered anyway because it's got welding to do. <sighs> there we go. Did I use the greaser? Yes, I did. Okay. Okay. I'm just checking the times. I am gonna have to go in a bit. I have some stuff I need to sort. To sort. Uh, so we'll we'll see if we keep up doing this Mustang streams in the next few days. Uh, keep progressing every now and then. So yeah. Hmm, let's see. Okay. Sound all that crap down. <sighs> what time is it? What time is it? I just need to keep track of the time. Uh, but but chat, I might need to end it here because I do need to go in like 15 minutes. Um, but we will continue. I'm gonna just finish this wing cleaning and I'll put it away. I might just primer the other one like a little bit later. Uh, and then I am gonna have to head off because I need to get to the shop and buy some stuff. You all have a wonderful afternoon. I'll probably stream again tonight. We'll probably stream tonight. Uh, I just need to get solving everything. Uh, yeah. But yeah, that's, that's kind of where we're at at the minute. We got the wings going. One of them's pretty clean. think it's just about ready for primer. Um, yeah, I think that's it. I think uh, that's what we got to do. So the next stream, I'll probably have one of the wings primered, uh, ready for the GravTech stuff whenever we start doing the whole rest of the car. Uh, so I need to do another layer underneath. I need to do the sides. I need to do the, the wings. And then that's it. That's it. Then we start getting pay payment on it. Uh, Banally, oh my god, yes, please. But yeah, chat, I think we'll end it there. Uh, see you all in tonight's stream. I'll try and do stream tonight a bit earlier because I need to check. Okay. Uh, but yeah, see you guys. Take care. Everyone, a wonderful 
afternoon, day, and see you guys tonight. And uh, Chupapi Munano out. Boo, bye bye. And don't.